what was peculiar about the scene that we all noticed was that uh, all of the bodies were found in virtually the same position, face down in the bed, arms above their heads. Uh, I, I can't think of how we can explain this away, how, how he did these six murders without any one of them hearing these shots or, and reacting to the shots. When I heard the details and I finally knew the whole story, it just helped me to understand that big, huge puzzle of how, just how evil does personify itself. There were six members of the family were found last night in bed, shot, and killed. The fact that he was able to shoot all six of them and no one going to the aid of anyone else and no one of those six hearing that shot and trying to get away. That doesn't add up at all. The theory was that some of these ghosts of the uh, Indians who had, uh, were buried there had arisen from the dead and uh, held them down or were accomplices in some way. I know the house made him do it. I'm positive of that. I don't believe there were any ghosts in that house. I don't think there ever were. I know there's not any there now. Nothing else can do that other than the intelligence of something inhuman.